If you're looking to give Windows 10 a test drive, you'll need to download the technical preview. Here's how to do it. First, go to the Windows Insider Program page. Click on Get Started at the bottom and follow the instructions. Then, click Join Now on the next page. You'll need to sign in with a Microsoft account. Then, go to the Install Technical Preview link here and click on it. Select the version you want to download, 32 or 64-bit, and then download the link next to your preferred language. The download comes in the form of an ISO file, which you should be able to install just by double-clicking it, and then double-clicking setup.exe if you are using Windows 8 or 8.1. And that should do it. But if you are using Windows 7 or an earlier version of Windows, such as XP, you can still install it by using a mounting program like Power ISO. However, when installing Power ISO, be sure to select Custom Installation. Otherwise, the installer will try to load bloatware onto your PC. After installing Power ISO, you'll need to restart your PC to use it. Once you have the Windows 10 Technical Preview ISO downloaded and Power ISO installed, you'll need to mount the Windows 10 ISO file in order to gain access to the install file. To do so, open Power ISO and click Mount Set Number of Drives, One Drive. Next, select this new drive, which will be in the same mount menu at the top. Mouse over it, then select and open the Windows 10 Technical Preview ISO file in order to mount it. From there, go to My Computer or This PC and the mounted ISO file should appear as a selectable drive. Double-click it and double-click Setup to begin the installation process. The setup program will take a few minutes to make sure you're ready to install and will also ask if you want to keep all your files and folders intact while making the switch over to Windows 10. Once you select your settings, hit Install and the installer should do the rest. Expect this process to take about 15 minutes or so depending on the speed of your computer.